Good morning. Hope you're doing good. Happy Friday to everybody. Looking forward to a relaxing, restful weekend. It's a little bit dark in here, so I apologize for the lighting, but I wanted to uh, leave more information about Bitcoin. I continue to get asked questions about it. And again, as always, my disclaimer before we get started, if you're going to make uh, an investment or considering an investment in Bitcoin or any other cryptocurrency, do that based on your own opinion. Make sure you do your own research and uh, don't do it just based on what I say. But I have been getting lots of questions about it. Just the other day, I dropped a video talking about what it would take for Bitcoin to be mainstream. And today, I want to talk about uh, how I think about investing in Bitcoin. What, what's been happening just yesterday, Bitcoin jumped. I believe it started the day around 14000 per Bitcoin. And I know it jumped right to the $20,000 per Bitcoin value. Now, that's a humongous jump in value. What's happening is, is there's plenty of hype about it. Every day, Squawk Box on CNBC and other shows are talking about the value of Bitcoin. You know, just a couple of weeks ago, it was under $7,000. And now we're talking about, I think this morning, it's at $16,000. So just as I said in the other video, we're seeing tons of volatility in the price. And yesterday, it was a huge swing. We saw a 50% jump in the value of it. Now, guess what happened late last night after all the hype, after all the buzz died, died down? Uh, late last night, it dropped all the way back down to about fourteen or 15000 Again, it's around 16000 this morning. I'll talk more about sort of what I'm seeing in terms of that here in just a second. But my point is, is a lot of people are riding or jumping on the bandwagon from a hype perspective. They're all excited about it. They're hearing other people talk about it. And they're jumping into it. Well, guess what? One of the worst times to buy into any investment, and this is how I think about things, one of the worst times to buy into any investment is when the buzz is at its peak. And that's kind of what we saw yesterday. Uh, now, I, I said I was going to talk about the volatility in terms of time of day. What I have been seeing, just to be clear, is that early morning pops in value, which it's done again this morning a little bit, and late, late evening pops in value. With the middle of the day, the value staying relatively the same. Again, it did move a lot yesterday, but on most days, it's staying within a $500 to $1,000 range, which sounds crazy for most stocks or investments, but for Bitcoin, that's not that big of a movement compared to what we've seen. So late, uh, late evening, early, early morning shifts in value, and I think what's happening there is everybody's getting off of work going home, signing on to providers like Coinbase and uh, purchasing their Bitcoins because they're hearing about all the hype about how it's going to hit 25000 in value, 30000 in value, all that kind of stuff. Well, as I said yesterday, that's what happened. The value just shot right up and then late everybody got home and it dropped. Now, there's a couple of reasons I think it dropped. I think the hype had finally died down. I think the value had got to the point where uh, people weren't willing to buy in. Now, keep in mind, you don't have to buy a full Bitcoin. You can buy fractions of a Bitcoin through providers. But the other thing that I think happened was is some of these providers, like the Coinbases of the world and others, they weren't able to process all of the transactions. Actually, what we saw was is I didn't try and sell or buy yesterday, but I was monitoring the value through Coinbase, and the site was really struggling with bandwidth. So I think some of the hype died down as people just couldn't get into services, couldn't buy or sell and they just sort of backed off the whole thing. So a couple of things going on driving that price and moving it around, but I think largely what did that was the hype had died down. Do not, my recommendation is never to buy into any investment when it's at the peak of its hype. Think about what would have happened yesterday. If you'd have got in, you'd have bought fractions of a Bitcoin when it was at 17, 18, 19, even $20,000 in value, with this whole thought that it was gonna shoot up to 25 or 30, either today or in a, even in a month or so, and then it dropped back down to 14000 you would have lost a lot of money. I'm actually part of a cryptocurrency group here in my city where we uh, get on a Facebook page and we talk about what's going on. And, and that was my advice yesterday. A lot of the people were jumping on saying, oh, I wish I had more money to invest in it right now. You know, 30000 here we come kind of thing. And I told them, I said, look, hold your horses. Yes, this is an opportunity to make some money. Volatility always creates opportunity for people to make money if they do the right thing. Uh, hype always creates the opportunity for people to make money if, you, if you're already in something and the hype sort of pushes its value up. So yes, there were opportunities to sell yesterday and make money, but some of those people were getting so excited, I was afraid they were going to run off and buy a bunch of Bitcoin thinking that it's going to hit 30000 in value. And again, look what happened. We dropped all the way to 14000 15000 I think luckily, you know, sort of, sort of pseudo luckily for some of them, the fact that the service providers couldn't process the trades quick enough may have saved some of them. So 
you know, what I'm doing, my plan is, is to hold on to what I've got. Uh, I did last week sell some of my Bitcoin when it hit what I thought was a really good value because I had bought in at a very, very low value. But I plan to hold on right now. You know, it's sort of a, it's nothing unique in my approach. What I'm doing is I'm holding on to mine right now with the thought that we're going to see another bit of a burst and it might drop back down and I can buy some more at a really good value and then hopefully ride that wave back up again. So it's this whole thing of buy, uh, buy low, sell high, right? There's nothing unique about what I'm doing. I'm just trying to caution you to be careful and don't buy into all the hype and certainly don't make your purchases in any investment when the hype is at its peak. Uh, if you want to get in, you have discretionary income, it could be a good time to buy into Bitcoin, but most likely if you buy in right now, you're going to have to wait a while to see that value push up to make it worth your time. So be patient. Uh, don't buy into the hype and make intelligent decisions based on what you think, not what everybody else is telling you. Collect your own data and, and trust in your own instincts and your own uh, what you see in a value in something. Hope you have a great weekend. We'll talk to you soon.